Here you go, beggar. Here's a nice cold beer to replenish your thirst. I think I hear someone coming. Telemachus, you're alive! Oh, Eumaeus, I'm so happy to see you. But who is this? It's just a beggar needing food and water. You need to take him to your palace and protect him. Okay. I must go seek Penelope to tell her the great news. Hey, come here. Hey, um, dude, I need to go to the bathroom. Hold on a second. Odysseus, reveal your true self to your son Telemachus. Ta-da, I'm all clean. You look so different. Are you a god? Where have you been all my life? I can't tell you now because... It's a really, really, really long story. Anyways, let's get back to business. What do the suitors look like? The two main suitors look like this. But that's not all. There's hundreds of more suitors following their lead. And many more. <laughs> and Telemachus, we can't fight that many suitors. But I must remind you, son, that Athena and Zeus are on our side. So go back to the palace and mingle with the crowd. And I will go later disguised as a beggar. Penelope, Telemachus has come home and is safe on the island. <laughs> Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. I can't believe he's still alive and made it up back on the island. A god probably saved Telemachus' life. As you can see here, Antonius was out drinking late last night and was not in any of the prior scenes. But from now on, he is sober and will be in the rest of the scenes. Since the gods helped Telemachus on his travels, I think we should kill him on our own side. I think we should only kill the prince, Telemachus, if the gods are in his yeah, favor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ta-da! You look ugly again.